PDAC 2019, and I'm with Paul Kuhn, the president and CEO of Avrupa Minerals. Paul, thank you so much for joining us here. Thanks, Angela, for having me. I'm good to see you again here. Absolutely, absolutely. So give us, uh, give our viewers a quick introduction to Avrupa and, and the, the project generator model. Well, we are a project generator. Our financial center is based in uh, Vancouver, and I'm running the technical in Portugal. Right. And we have projects in Portugal. We have projects in Kosovo. Uh, we are working on a potential joint venture partner in Portugal. We've just finished drilling on that project called Avalad. We have a discovery there made a few years ago and now we are putting some real money into it. We finished six holes, yep. 2,500 meters. Mm -hmm. We expect to have results out to the marketplace within the week or so. Yeah. And it uh, looks pretty good so far. Okay, And that's a gold project, correct? Uh, the, no, sorry, that's a lead zinc project. Uh, sorry, zinc copper project in the pyrite belt of South Portugal. Okay. We have, a, we have a gold project in Kosovo, and we hold about 10% of it. Uh, our Australian partner has put in 7 million euros. There's a nice resource, small, high-grade resource, about 100, 125,000 ounces, surface mineable, and we have a group that's looking to perhaps purchase the, the deposit, which would generate some um, non-dilutive cash for us. So why the why the European focus? What was it the potential that you see in you know Portugal and Kosovo and perhaps other European countries? Well, when we started Avrupa back in 2010, there wasn't really anybody doing project generation in Europe, and we quickly picked up on Kosovo and Portugal and a couple of other places, and found uh, good geology, potential mineralization, and we made a discovery first in Portugal, massive sulfide. And then we made a gold discovery in Kosovo back in 2014. And now we're finally beginning to move those ahead, at least in Portugal. Kosovo one, like I said, is got a resource on it. We have a partner that's pushing it. And we're also going to do some more generative exploration in, in, uh, in Kosovo this year. So, Paul, what's on the agenda then for 2019? And what are you, what are you looking at uh, in terms of news flow? 2019 is going to be um, getting joint venture partner in Portugal. Uh, we have a, a gold copper project in Portugal that needs a little work and a new partner. We're, we'll do that this, this uh, first uh, quarter one and quarter two. Quarter two, quarter three is going to be dedicated to Kosovo for sure. Like I said, we've got a, a generative alliance starting up, we hope, in early part of quarter two. Uh, we hope the sale of the Slivovo Gold project will take part in quarter two in 2019. And I'm looking for new ideas to fill the bottom of the pipeline. So I'm looking in Morocco, a little bit in Germany, maybe Bulgaria. Yeah. Uh, but but I've got to I got to fill the bottom end of the pi pipeline now. Yeah. So. yeah, absolutely. Get those new exploration projects. We, we need some new exploration projects. Yeah. That's correct. Yeah. 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 Excellent. Well, we will uh, we'll look out for news from Avrupa Minerals. Thank you so news much, Paul. Soon. So okay. be be prepared. Okay. <laughs> Thanks, Angela. Thank you. Thank you.